Blink, blink. Yummy. Are we rolling? Ready? Are we rolling? It's, we're, well, I think we're rolling. Okay. So, Diane, you know I was in Texas recently. Yes. And I, I asked my daughter the other day, I said, have you seen my newspaper? Uh -huh. And she said, uh... Newspapers are really old school. Everyone's using tablets now. So she handed me her iPad. That fly never stood a chance. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> good one, good one. <laughs> well, I'm glad you're back. Oh, thanks. Kind of. Kind of. Yeah. So, uh, we're ready to shoot then? We're going? B-O-E. Uh, no, it isn't. Uh, how could that possibly not say bowl once in a while? No, and it's kind of interesting. Last week, I think I said that the winner was Gail Koss right across the street. And so I, she knew about it before I announced it. Well, this week, the winner knows about it, too, because she's the treasurer of the community club. It's, it's kind rigged. of hard. Rigged. Uh, you really shouldn't even put that idea in other people's heads. <laughs> If it were rigged, you and I would be winning, all that's right? True, Especially me. So it is Daniil Shipman. And she already has her check because she just kept it. I have nothing to mail to her. So congratulations, Daniil. All right, Diane, what are we talking about today? Well, it kind of looks like you're not talking about much at all. I see it's pretty empty well, over there. I, I've got some I was good planning things. on talking about Yeti and Turvis and no, Chess, no, no. and you we're, stole my idea. So like usual, Boy. always stealing my ideas. Some things don't change. I tell you do guys, they? always, <laughs> always. Ah. <laughs> oh, phew! So these are my ideas, then. Okay, Roger, whatever. That was a good one. <laughs> <laughs> there really is okay. only one Roger, isn't there? Put that up there again in front of. What do you think? Can we replace Roger? Yeah, this, probably this not. This here, here. This, this here, here, here? Tervis. This here, here. Huh? <laughs> okay, good one. All right. We miss you, okay. Roger. That's funny. Yeah, yeah, we do. Okay, so we're going to be talking about some things. And actually, I've asked Raina to help me today because I don't like doing this alone. And she is going to give a couple of testimonies of some things that she uses I, from the store here. I really liked what you and Shirley did a few weeks ago. And that's always helpful, helpful for me to know that somebody has actually used the product <laughs> they're selling. <laughs> we're not saying this and that. We never have sold one yet. Yeah. Okay, we do sell... And so I, will you go ahead and talk about your stuff? I'm okay. not going to interrupt you like Roger does. Oh, really? <laughs> okay. I didn't say that. You know, I mentioned this last week, but I think it was a little bit hard to comprehend. This fits on all sizes of our Yeti water bottles, even this big one. And you're looking and saying, yeah, but you're not going to get to the bottom and drink. The straw comes and is really long, made for this longer water bottle, and it shows you where to cut it off. So you cut it off and stick it in the hole that's provided and get rid of this old lid that we don't like quite so well put your new lid in it won't leak it's wonderful and you flip that up and that's your straw and they made it i think they call it nose friendly or something like that so it's not going to hit your nose while you're drinking out of it so that is the attachment that you can buy to fit the water bottles that ash does i guess i am interrupting you <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. So it does work, look nice because I have one size like this, and it is a big, wide area to... Yeah, yeah. You know, so. And so last year I bought 17 of these water bottles for my adult grandchildren and children. This year I get to buy 17 of these. It's going to be a big price difference. I'm loving it. Okay. Well, can I, since you're on the topic of Yeti, yes. I, just, um, I bought this for my friend Marcy, and she loves it. And so... And it, it's a great gift idea. So these these work well and are really great. One so. thing I like about that size, it has a really cool little handle that makes it like a cup. And it, it's a cup handle. And it's, so you've got a coffee cup. Yeah. They now make a coffee cup also. But, okay, I wanted to point out, we've talked to uh, Tervis Tumbers forever, but we have some really cute kid patterns in them. Batman, Spider-Man, uh, Polar... Express. Express. Um, 
some dinosaurs we've got star wars just some really cute ones that are in the smaller size for kids and then we also obviously have all the twins and all the vikings and and that was one of the things that i wanted to give a testimony on to um I have Vikings ones, of course, <laughs> yeah, <no. laughs> and I love my Termos tumblers, um, and I love that, I know Roger teases, but they don't sweat. I mean, so my table's not getting all wet, and, and I drink tea out of it, and I, I love mine. I was down at my uh, daughter's this weekend in the cities, <coughs> and I had given one of these to my son-in-law who rides his bicycle to work, and he probably doesn't dare put his Yeti in his bicycle and leave it there but he's got a little holder that this is strapped right into his bicycle thing and when he needs a drink he's going down the road and he can so we only a have a few seconds left but i i did want to tell you i um these are really neat too the the chirpy top i got one for a friend of mine she loves it um and yep, that cool pour in your wine um and then another thing that i really liked that i use all the time are my gloves uh, mm -hmm. They're awesome, and, and, and I love what you had said that just wash your hands with soap and water like you normally would, and in, it cleans in the gloves. In the sink, yeah, yeah, leave the gloves on. So. And you know, we don't usually think of this type of thing as being a Christmas gift, but you know, hey, stocking Perfect stuffers stocking are wonderful. Stuff. Right. Yeah, and then chocolate covered coffee beans. Oh, sorry, right? I'm interrupting. Oh, I was well, that's how it works. To do we're, that. we're both going to hurry and get things in at the and last minute. And then I have a Droll Yankee uh, bird feeder. I've got two of them, and I love them. They really do hold up to the elements. And uh, and if they I don't, their lifetime warranty. You bring them into us and we repair them and send you back home with and what I looks like a brand new And I love the one that you said you even <laughs> repaired the one that was shot at. <laughs> uh, yeah, that was early on in the company. It's like, that isn't really what the warranty is. Tell them to aim a little better <laughs> next time. But now we have our own tubes so we don't have to go through the company. You know, we've got a lot of games. Uh, I just brought out two chess ones, but we've got Tansy and we've got puzzles. And we've got a lot of fun things. Um, there's only, by the time you watch this, there's going to be less than, well, there's only going to be three days left to stock up on your bird food, uh, chai tea a lot of you stock up on, some of you stock up on your fragrance for your la-di-da burners. Don't forget, we're going to be closed for four months this winter. We, my last day here in the store is December 23rd, and we open again on April 26th, and we will have the garden center again seven days a week like we have. So Roger has, the real Roger, has asked me to express thanks to you for helping us make another good year. And I guess with that, we'd like to say Merry Christmas, and we will see you next year. Merry Christmas. Thanks okay. for letting me help you today. <laughs> help you. That was good. <laughs> Thanks, Raj uh, Raina. <laughs> okay. Um, next, can I, we'll do I you. still have time? Uh, we I always guess. make time. Oh. Okay, what else is new? <laughs> she has no control. Um, uh, we're open only three days now this next week, and that will be uh, final. So it's Thursday and Friday, 10 to 5.30, and Saturday, 9 to 2. So, Merry Christmas. See you Goodbye. in April. Okay.